That's right, it's time for another update here in Minnesota. It's below zero. Imagine that. Yeah, being winter, it gets kind of cold here. As you can see, I'm having a hard time seeing, but hopefully you'll enjoy just laughing about it right now. All right, well, let's uh, give you an update. Last night I went out and got some materials and uh, tools and stuff to help with some of the stuff that we're doing on the bus frame. I showed you guys a video about with all the rust and... Uh, in the sections on the frame and just need to address that so what I'm doing right now is I'm I'm going through and I've I've got out taking a wire wheel to it with a grinder and uh, just getting getting the paint and all that other sort of stuff off of it so we got bare metal we can see exactly what it is that we're dealing with right there so I just want to show you my setup so that um, you guys can get some ideas as to uh, how you might want to do this if you guys are doing this in a bus uh, what I did was I went out and I got some some welding sheets from Harbor Freight and I set up a little little room right here in the middle of the bus around the areas that have the problem. So we'll go ahead and walk on in here. See that here's one of the main spots that we have the issues with. Gone through with a wire wheel and Taking a lot of the paint off, get a clean surface. So if we do some welding, we cut it out, all that sort of stuff. Um, but there's that one, and did the same thing along this side. There's all that nasty rust going on there. Yeah, and then on this side. It's where it's really bad. And over here, just started getting working on this one, as you can see. So, but uh, I'm getting pretty cold, so I'm going to probably go in. But uh, just a quick scan of what you may want to do with setting this up. I just kind of jerry a lot of stuff around here. We got uh, C clamps on the rail right there, holding up some of the uh, sheets. You can get these at Harbor Freight. Uh, using some ropes, and uh, these are kind of kind of cool this is what uh, held the insulation in up here so you can use these tabs you know just just uh, hang some stuff but yeah just kind of hung it all up the reason why I did this is that we don't want any we want to protect our bus windows so that we don't have any any bits of metal flying into them right now so we want to keep them keep them nice and clean and uh, we don't want any any weld uh, sparks or um, fragments from doing the grinding to go off and embed themselves in those windows. So this is just a uh, safety precaution to uh, make sure that that doesn't happen so we can you know save a little money and won't have to replace windows. Catch you guys later.